Hello guys and welcome to EC Electronics. So in today's video, we are going to see another very big recruitment opportunity from Bharat Electronics Limited. Recently, we have seen a big recruitment uh, from uh, BEL for Bangalore location. Now the Chennai unit is also hiring for another uh, post with multiple opportunities for different branches, especially for electronics candidates. That is our main area of interest. So we are going to see all the details about this, how to apply for it, what is the eligibility, what is the age limit, how much post is there, selection process, everything we are going to see here. Please watch the video till the end so that you get all the information and you can find all the links in the description. So let's see that. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please consider subscribing. Uh, it doesn't cost anything and useful uh, informations and job updates you can get daily uh, on your phone. Okay. So let's see the recruitment update for fixed term basis uh, hiring for deputy engineer post. So deputy engineer generally whenever they are hiring freshers, it's maximum for two years or maximum up to three years. But this is like for five years they are hiring and that is absolutely freshers. No experience, nothing is required. So deputy engineer E2 on fixed term, uh, term basis. B B Tech, A M I E, G I E T E, B S C are uh, also eligible. E C E they are hiring with eleven post. Same uh, MEC eight post, C S C two post, Civil one post, and Triple E also they are hiring with one post. So maximum opportunity is for E C E candidates. The age limit is twenty eight is the upper age limit. Obviously there is age relaxation for the backward categories like non creamy layer three years scheduled cast scheduled tribe five years persons with benchmark disabilities 10 years yeah these are all uh, very good especially uh, if you want to get hired as a fresher here age limit is not 25 years i believe for the last one it was 25 years this is 28 years they have increased the age to three more years for general category again age relaxation is applicable for the reserved category so that is very good because I believe a lot of people commenting below that video that we don't have a, like I am 25 years and some months uh, older as per the requirement. So can I apply like that? And many people was having difficulty in applying. And even though they were uh, saying that final years are also eligible, some people was not able to uh, apply there. So those kind of things, if you are facing some trouble, I, I believe there is a... Uh, last that is a helpline number so please contact them they will be the uh, right persons to answer those kind of questions okay now let's see what is the requirement okay okay so electronics in the electronics itself which are the relevant branches that are eligible electronics is eligible electronics and communication electronics and telecommunication communication telecommunication all these streams are eligible for electronics so I believed I answered your question because I, I know that a lot of people are going to comment below the video and uh, ask for this question. So uh, electronics, electronics communication, electronics telecommunication, that is ENTC, communication engineering, telecommunication, all these streams are eligible. For mechanical, mechanical engineering is the only stream mentioned. Computer science, it is computer science, computer science and engineering, computer science, engineering, these are the streams. Civil, civil engineering, electrical, electrical and electronics engineering and electrical engineering yeah these are the uh, categories that are eligible okay uh, so you are category or obc or economically weaker sessions you need to have minimum first class in order to apply for this but for the case of scst persons with disabilities pass classes only required for all the post indicated candidates should have uh, means you should be having a degree from the recognized university uh, okay, so everything they have mentioned here. Okay, let's have a look on the selection methodology. Selection methodology consists of written tests nowadays, uh, especially for freshers. BL follows this criteria. We have also made a video on that. If you want to refer that, please check it in the uh, video session. Or I'll be putting that in the description or in the comment session so that it is easy for you to find out. Selection is based me, uh, done based on the written test. And then interview. Generally, it is 85 15 percentage. 85 percentage is mark, uh, mark is from the written test and 15 percentage mark from the interview. 
Written test will be consisting of objective type questions with 150 marks from your technical domain and general aptitude. Mostly questions is from your technical domain. Selection process will be happening based on the written test and the interview. Candidate who qualify the criteria are accepted to log into the website and you have to download the call letter that is the hall ticket you have to download from the BL side. They won't send it to you. You have to download it. This is one important thing you have to uh, note down because please don't wait for them to email the hall ticket. They won't do that. You have to check the site and you have to download the hall ticket by yourself. For the written test, there is questions from general aptitude and it consists of questions from the logical reasoning, analytical reasoning, comprehension ability, basic numerical questions, data interpretation, skills, general knowledge, etc. Technical aptitude consists of technical questions, professional uh, knowledge, etc. Qualifying marks is 35 percentage of uh, 35 percentage mark that is total combining the interview and the test. General category 35 percentage. SCST persons with disabilities this 30 percentage. Written exam will be tentatively happening on February March uh, months. Okay. And uh, yeah, they have not mentioned that final years are eligible. So you guys are not eligible to apply uh, for this because the age limit also they have increased to 28. So I think they are not looking for final years here. Yeah, but in case if I have missed it out, I'll put that in the uh, comments. Okay. Yeah. Uh, only Indian nationals are up, eligible to apply. Uh, yeah, not more than one applications should be submitted. Online applications uh, should be complete. If it is incomplete, they won't be considering that. All those informations, just like all the general recruitment. Okay, so there is also fees for applying. The fees is 472 for uh, people who are belonging to the general category. If you are belonging to SCST category, persons with disabilities or ex-service are exempted from paying the fees. Generally, all these categories like SCST, PW, uh, BD and ex-serviceman. For some uh, exams, women category are also exempted from pay paying the fees. And I believe that the payment should be done through SBI collect, state bank collect. And if you have previously done the payment for BEL, then you should be pretty familiar with that. Otherwise, they have given a very detailed instruction for making the payment. Go to the online SBI.com site. Go to SBI Bank, uh, State Bank Collect. Accept the terms and service, uh, conditions. Select type Corporation Institute PSU. Under the PSU, you have to go for the recruitment of... First, you have to select BEL. Then you have to select the Deputy Engineers 2. Uh, then make the payment. You have to also uh, save the reference collect uh, reference number. Okay, SBA collects reference number. You have to save. Yeah. And also, they have given a list of documents that need to be uploaded while you are making the online um, application process. Birth date proof, scanned passport size photo, all certificates, all semester mark sheets, qualifying degree certificate, uh, conversion formula because different universities has different conversion formula. So. It should stick to the 60 percentage. Whatever formula you are following, finally, it should be 60 percentage. Cast certificate if you are looking for a reservation. Disability certificate if you are having a reservation in that category. No objection certificate. So everything is given in detail. Last date for applying is 6th of February. Now, very, very important. They have given in case of queries or questions, please contact the email ID. And the phone number which you can see on the screen. I'll be putting that uh, in the description also if you have any questions. Because they will be the right persons uh, in terms of age or in terms of conversion formula. If you have some difficulty, they are the right persons to contact. So that's all for today's video. BEL has a lot of opportunities now. So BEL is one company that you can always focus on. Because they have every year they announce a lot of opportunities or openings. Even... Uh, ISRO, they hire like uh, maybe in two years or three years only. But BEL, Bharat Electronics Limited, since they have this kind of fixed term post, they hire very frequently and it's a very good place to get some experience. So if you're looking for an experience, if you want to start your career, then this is the right place. Uh, start applying if you're eligible. 
For more of these videos, please subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and keep on watching.